Hey, what's up, guys? It's King Canuck here. I'm coming at you with a brand new video. In this video, I'll be playing some Nuketown Domination. I was playing with, I think, one other person, maybe two. It was one of my homies, Rush Easy. He's, he's goaded at this game. We were both trying to get, like, you know, double, triple nukes in this game. He was watching one side, I was watching the other. Uh, we we're both using the AUG. I know it's scummy to use the AUG, but this is, like, when it first came out for Nuketown. This was recorded, like, two weeks ago. I'm just getting to it now because I'm sort of lazy. But it's a 74 gun streak uh, with the AUG. It, these spawn traps that we got were nasty. <clears throat> I don't really play Nuketown anymore because it's sort of like, well, I reverse boost. So it's sort of hard to get not thrown into games. So I usually just play 12v12. And 12v12 is pretty good. I mean, it's sometimes the games last pretty quick. You won't get high scores like I do. Like, I think I'm in, what, top 60 right now in the world for score in this game. Just from the Yukon, basically, because it's the score you get is insane. <clears throat> like, I can get 30k score around, so around 60k a game. It's not too bad. But, uh, yeah, it's it's coming to the first season, I think, in a couple days. I think, yeah, Wednesday. Today's Monday. So, it will be in a couple days. So, they'll have Nuketown. The Christmas version of Nuketown. Like, it's cool and all, but, you know, it's just Nuketown. <laughs> They have Raid, which I can't wait to play. Raid's going to be so good. <clears throat> then there, there's that Pine map. Don't really know how that's going to play. It's going to be weird. And they have a couple new game modes coming out. New guns, new AR, SMG. It's not going to be too, too bad. Test out some new assault rifles. Uh, then they have the... Uh, what's called? The Prestiges coming at 1,000 levels. Like Four more Prestiges at 1,000 levels. That's not too bad. Hopefully grind my way to like level maybe four or five hundred by the end of the weekend. Like by the end of this week. But it's gonna be interesting to see how raid plays. I actually can't wait for that. That's gonna I just just need something new. It's sort of boring playing this game at this point. Like 'cause all the maps are just stale. Like all the <coughs> all like the maps they brought out in the game. Not like the uh, the uh, throwback like Nuketown, it's sort of boring, stale right now. You see, I was 53 and two after the first round. Like this gun, I don't use it anymore. It is actually a more broken gun than the than the AUG, which will be in the video tomorrow. That gun is actually insane. Like I feel bad for like people that get shit on by the stoner. It's so good. Like I don't even. I don't even know what they're gonna do for updates. Like, are they gonna patch these guns? And how is it gonna be like for integrating into Warzone? It's gonna be weird seeing like you know the AUG one hits people with 150 health. God, God I'm so tired. Uh, and then they're gonna have like all these guns integrating. It's just gonna be crazy. I wanna I wanna know how that plays. It's gonna be pretty cool though. You see, I'm about to get the nuke here. Also, this is recording when I took this gate like these clip right here where i'm getting this big streak i was actually on a 20 and died before i got this nuke so i could have been probably double triple nuke if i really wanted to a quad of teammates didn't like you know like the flip spots all the time because that always happens like i teammates just always love the cap flags like i could probably get like a quad nuke on nuketown it's not hard but it's when teammates literally triple cap and I hate spawn protection, man. It's one thing I love about ground war. There's not really any spawn protection, per se. Because when I get the gunship up, it's not as heavy spawn protection on that game compared to, like, Nuketown. I don't use the gunship on Nuketown. I tried that before. It was not fun. Like, you can't really kill anyone. Look at this. Like, I know it's reverse boosted. They're not the greatest players. I'm not trying to say I'm good at all. But, you know, it's fun. It's, the game's supposed to be for fun. See, I pick up an AUG there. That's uh, Rush Easy's AUG. He has Dark Aether or whatever it's called. Basically Dark Matter. I would go for it. But I'm also not trying to grind zombies. Don't even want to go for the multiplayer one. It's so ugly. I'd rather just keep the diamond camo. It's pretty good. Diamond looks pretty nice on all the guns. I still need to go for, I think, LMG's diamond. And maybe shotguns if I want to try for them. But I don't know. I don't like going for diamond that much. It's not really interesting anymore. Considering 
Holy fuck. Uh, considering I don't really use many guns, I think I've, the stoner I've used the last week, basically. I used the AUG in one game because some kid wanted to try and with using the AUG. I think I just use some, I use some AR sometimes now, but just mostly the stoner because that gun just like, it literally three shots people. Like they literally stand no chance. And has like an 118 bullets. Yeah, see my, my controller when I'm charging it, it's so fucked. So that blue screen there, that almost fucked me over. I was pretty cheesed there, I'm pretty sure. But it's sort of weird looking back at this gameplay right here. You know, watching and, and post comment this because I don't really play like this anymore. I don't play like with the AUG as I did here. You know, I sort of like don't run into their spawn as much. Like, it's sort of weird. And the kill streaks, I don't use those ones anymore because I use the napalm now. And I don't even use armor, which actually I should start using armor again if I play Nuketown or Raid. But when Raid comes out, I'm going to try and get a triple nuke on Raid. It's going to be difficult, but I think I could do it. I haven't got a triple nuke in this game yet. I've got doubles, a lot of double nukes. But, whew. but no triples, because every time I go for them, we either, it's close to the end of the game, and we're triple capping, and I run out and I die, or the game ends off a triple nuke. So it's sort of sort of hard. I usually just play solo or in like a one or two man, maybe three people if, uh, if we're trying to reverse boost with three of us. But solo is really hard to get on Nuketown. Considering like with one account, you just keep getting thrown in games. And it's always like kill confirmed with TDM. But when I play 12v12, it's so good. Like the gameplay tomorrow is actually really good gameplay. It's insane how good I did. But it's because I was just, mo like, my teammates were actually not actually having the flag the whole time on Assault. They last, they didn't even last, like, it was, could have been, like, a triple nuke on that game if I actually tried. But I used the gunship, of course, and that got me a lot of kills. Like, yesterday I was playing in one game, gunship got me 45 kills. <laughs> but we won when I was in the gunship. <sighs> We expect more content from me coming up here. You know, I'm going to come back on that YouTube grind because this game's actually enjoyable compared to, like, Modern Warfare. And actually enjoy playing this game. I think I already have more time playing this game, multiplayer-wise, than Modern Warfare. But Warzone, I, I'll i be definitely re posting some Warzone. But the video's coming to an end here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you have a like, comment, and subscribe, I guess, and have a good day, and enjoy this final clip here before I get destroyed off my nuke. Right up here is where I get shit on.